Number 8. The 8C Spider concept was unveiled by Alfa Romeo in 2005, but it took three years for the production model to debut at the Geneva Motor Show in 2008. A 4.7-liter V8 engine with 444 ponies and 354 pound-feet of torque powers, the 8C Spider. It works with a six-speed automated manual transmission that drives the rear wheels. The Spider can sprint from 0 to 62 in 4.4 seconds and has a top speed of 181 miles per hour. Alfa Romeo initially planned to make 500 Spiders, but only 329 were eventually built, and just 35 reached the U.S. market. Number 7 The Alfa Romeo RZ is a rare and exclusive sports car that was produced by the Italian automaker in collaboration with Zagato. The RZ stands for Roadster Zagato, and it is the convertible version of the Alfa Romeo SZ, a coupe with a distinctive angular design. Unlike the SZ, it comes in not only red but also yellow, black, and rarely silver for the Japanese market. The RZ was based on the Alfa Romeo 75 platform, and it was powered by a 3-liter V6 engine that delivered 207 horses. Alfa Romeo originally planned to produce 350 roadsters, but due to the relatively high selling price, only about 284 units left the factory in the end. Number 6. The Giulia TZ is a legendary sports car that was born in the 1960s as a collaboration between Alfa Romeo and Zagato. The TZ stands for Tubolare Zagato, which refers to the tubular space frame chassis that made the car lightweight and agile. It also had a sleek and aerodynamic bodywork with a low bonnet, a swooping roofline, and a flat cam tail that reduced drag and lift. It was powered by a 1.6-liter twin-cam engine that produced 112 horses for the road version and 160 ponies for the race version. The coupe weighs only 1,430 pounds and has a top speed of 134 miles per hour, making it one of the fastest cars of its time. Alfa Romeo manufactured 112 Giulia TZ cars from 1963 to 1965. Number 5 Unveiled at the 2018 Geneva Motor Show, the 4C Competizione was based on the 4C Coupe but featured several enhancements that make it even more exclusive and desirable. It has a carbon fiber tub that weighs only 143 pounds, giving it a remarkable power-to-weight ratio. It was powered by a 1.8-liter turbocharged four-cylinder engine that produces 237 horses and is paired with a dual-clutch transmission. The car can go from 0 to 62 in just 4.5 seconds and has a top speed of 160 miles per hour. The engine sounds fantastic, thanks to a titanium Acropovic exhaust system that reduces weight and airflow. The 4C Competizione is a limited edition of only 108 units, all with a matte Vesuvio gray finish. Number 4 The Alfa Romeo 33 Stradale is a mid-engine sports car that was built between 1967 and 1969. It was based on the Tipo 33 racing car, which competed in various endurance and hill climb events. The 33 Stradale, which means road going in Italian, was designed by Franco Scaglione. Only 18 units were produced, making it one of the rarest and most desirable Alfa Romeos ever. The car weighed only 1,543 pounds, thanks to its aluminum and magnesium alloy construction. It was powered by a 2-liter V8 engine with 227 horsepower and 152 pound-feet of torque, enough to sprint from 0 to 60 in 5.5 seconds, and has a top speed of 162 miles per hour. It was the fastest commercially available car for the standing kilometer when introduced. It was also one of the first supercars of the modern era, combining racing performance with street legality and comfort. 
It costs up to $17,000 at the time of release. Number 3. The Alfa Romeo TZ3 is a rare and beautiful sports car that pays tribute to the legendary Alfa Romeo TZ models of the 1960s. It was created in 2010 to celebrate the 100th anniversary of Alfa Romeo, and it consists of two versions, the Corsa and the Stradale. The Corsa is a one-off track car based on the 8C Competizione, while the Stradale is a road car based on the Dodge Viper ACR. Only nine examples of the Stradale were made, making it a collector's dream. The TZ3 Stradale combines the power of an American V10 engine with the grace of an Italian design. It can reach over 200 miles per hour and accelerate from 0 to 60 in just 3.5 seconds. Number 2. The C52 Disco Volante was a series of experimental sports racing cars produced by Alfa Romeo and Carrozzeria Touring in 1952 and 1953. The name Disco Volante, which means flying saucer in Italian, was inspired by the car's futuristic and aerodynamic design. The car was based on the Alfa Romeo 1900 but used a lighter aluminum engine block and a tubular space frame chassis. The bodywork was wind tunnel tested to achieve a low drag coefficient of 0.25, which allowed the car to reach a top speed of around 140 miles per hour. The Disco Volante was intended to race in the Le Mans and Mille Miglia, but it never competed officially due to Alfa Romeo's financial difficulties. Only five examples were built, of which four survive today. Number 1. Based on the Giulia Quadrifoglio, Zagato created the one-of-a-kind Giulia SWB to honor their partnership with Alfa Romeo over the past 100 years. It features a unique two-door coupe body with a shortened wheelbase, a carbon fiber construction, and a double bubble roof. It was powered by a twin-turbo 2.9-liter V6 engine upgraded to GTM spec, delivering 533 ponies and 443 pound-feet of torque. Unlike the GTM, which only has an automatic transmission, the Giulia SWB retains the six-speed manual gearbox offered on the European Quadrifoglio. The one-off was built for a German customer, a loyal Alfa Romeo enthusiast, and owner of many of the company's rare cars.